everyone, it's me, Cindy, and today I will be teaching you how to regroup with tens and ones. Let's get started. Lesson one. Lesson one. So we're going to start by doing this math problem. So we have our tens and we have our ones. And we're going to start by adding our ones. So our one and our nine, we're going to add those two up. So one and nine, so one plus nine equals, do you know what it is? It equals ten. But instead of us putting the one with the zero, we're going to cross out the one. And I'm going to also make my zero bigger so you guys can see. So now we're going to carry our 1 to our tenths place. So we're going to now add up our tenths place. We're adding up our 5 and our 1. Our 5 and our 1. So 1 and 5 equals, do you know what it is? It equals 6. So we're going to draw a big 6, small 6, whatever size, whatever size you're right with. And then our total is? Our answer, our total answer is 60. So now we're going to move on to another math problem. This one is a different math problem, though. So we have our tens and we have our ones again. So we're going to start by doing our one again. So we're, our ones again. So we're going to start by adding our seven and our nine this time. So seven plus 9 equals, do you know what it is? It equals 16. So yet again, what, you're not going to put the 1 and the 6. You're just going to put the plain 6, like what we did with the 0 over here. So now, you're going to carry your 1 here, just like we did with our last one. And you're going to add up. This time, you're not adding up the 5, you're adding up the 2. So you're going to add up the 1 with the 2. So 1 plus 2 equals, do you know what it is? It equals 3. You're going to draw a 3, big, small. And our total answer is 36. So you guys, I hope you liked our math problems. And basically what this is, you're just teaching how to add, but instead, because normally you would add them up and you would put the 10 there, and then you would put another number. Well, they would already have those, and then you would just add it up. But this time, you're gonna, you have, would have to draw the numbers, and you're putting whichever number. So this is basically just a little example. We are, will be doing more of this in lesson two. But I hope you liked lesson one and I hope you liked this video. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and turn on your notification bells because you don't want to miss some of these learning videos because some of these learning videos you might get in school. And then if you don't watch this, then you'll be dumb as a pig. So I hope you liked this video. Bye! Ha <laughs> ha